in Melbourne, an international conference has heard Australia has precious little knowledge about its exposure to damaging tsunamis. Researchers say there's evidence giant waves have hit our coastline in past centuries, but more work needs to be done to assess the ongoing risk. In a modern media age, the frequency and impacts of tsunamis are terrifyingly clear. Australia now has warning systems and computer modelling for much of the populated coastline. But scientists say more research is needed into how tsunamis have impacted upon this country in the past. We know almost nothing, almost nothing. And you look at what's even just happened in the last five to ten years of modern history and you think, good grief, we know nothing prior to about 150, 200 years ago. Professor James Goff will tell an international earth sciences conference in Melbourne that little is also known about potential threats in the Pacific. And there's a lot of nasty potential tsunami sources out there and there are two in particular I'm, I'm very interested in or, or getting concerned about, let's say, at the moment. Namely, a submarine volcano off Vanuatu, which is ten times bigger than Krakatoa, and a long fault line running north from New Zealand. And Professor Goff's not alone in his assessment. We are not fully prepared because we do not know what has happened in the past. But they say the necessary research would be complex. This two-week conference will also hear about new evidence gained as a result of recent earthquakes in Japan, Indonesia and New Zealand, which may help planners identify danger zones. Australian scientists have developed a new underground mapping technique which appears to show which areas around quake zones are more likely to suffer damage. This is not earthquake prediction, it's not even earthquake forecasting. It is simply another piece of information that can be added into the risk analysis. One of the most immediate locations the new science could help is around Christchurch in New Zealand. Jeff Waters, ABC News.